Hi guys and welcome to 123myIT. In this video we will show you how to use the Mac M1 boot commands. These are helpful if you need to troubleshoot or work on your Mac for any reason. This video will show you how to open up startup options, start the Mac with diagnostics, recovery and safe modes. Also show you how to set a default startup volume. Let's get started. I am using a MacBook Pro M1 computer. The first step is to shut down the Mac. Once your Mac is shut down, to get into the Startup Options menu, press and hold the power button until you see the Apple logo with Continue Holding Startup Options menu. When you see the Options cog, you can let go of the power button. This is the Startup Options menu and you can do things like select bootable disks. To get into Diagnostics mode, we want to press and hold the Command and D keys until your Mac restarts and you will see the Diagnostics menu load up. Now you might need to connect the Mac to your Wi-Fi to start the diagnostics. Once you have connected to the Wi-Fi, the diagnostics will download and you can use the diagnostics to see if you have a hardware problem with your Mac. Just click run offline and the Mac will check all your hardware to see if it's okay. I get an error message about the power adapter because mine is not plugged in. If you click get started, it will show you a list of error codes. So if you have faulty hardware, you can contact Apple with the error code and you will be able to get some help there. If I plug my cable back in and I run the test again, I don't get any error codes. This means that the Mac hardware is fine and working correctly. If you want to check startup disk, reinstall Mac OS, restore from backup or change security settings, go into recovery mode by pressing the options cog. So in the recovery menu, you have restore from time machine, Reinstall Mac OS, Disk Utility, and Browse Apple Support. Safe Mode allows you to flush user caches and disable third party extensions. To get into Safe Mode, go back into the Startup menu and press and hold the Shift key. Then click Continue in Safe Mode underneath it. Your Mac will restart itself, and then you should be able to see the safe mode in the top right hand menu. Simply log on and your Mac will be in safe mode. If you want to set a default startup disk, go back into the startup menu and press and hold the option key. Underneath the disks, it will show an always use option. This allows you to set the default startup disk. Helpful if you have multiple disks. Guys, don't forget to check out my other videos such as Fix Broken Bricked Mac with Restore or Revive option. This will show you how to put an M1 Mac into DFU mode. Also, do me a favor, if you know anyone who might need this video, please share it with them, hit the subscribe button, and smash the bell icon.